Now at 11, the Fed makes the most aggressive move yet to curb sky-high inflation. Good evening. I'm Ryan Yamamoto. And I'm Elizabeth Cook. KPIX 5's Andrea Nakano on what it means for you and your wallet. The Federal Reserve is using a tool it has to slow down the economy and stop the record high inflation. But it's a fine line to walk here with the threat of a recession looming. U.S. stocks closed slightly higher after the Federal Reserve announced its biggest rate hike in nearly 30 years. The last time they went up this high was in 1994. So it's been a while. They're, what they're really trying to do is use some of the tools that they have to curb inflation. Senior Vice President Chris Harris with CMG Financial says consumers will be hit hard if they owe money. They're going to see this in, in many places. Uh, they're going to see this um, in their credit card spending um, and car loans. They're going to see this in the mortgage rates. This is the country is in the midst of a 40 year high inflation. Inflation. It's sapping the strength of a lot of families. Families are now spending $350 more a month than they did last year to buy the same products. At CMG Financial, it's seen mortgage rates nearly triple since the beginning of the year, marking one of the largest increases over this short period of time. At the start of the year, we knew interest rates were going to go up. Um, we did not predict um, in the mortgage industry that they were going to go up this quickly. While the increase was steep, experts are saying that more rate hikes could come in the future. Andrea Nakano, KPIX 5.